YouTube. In this video, we'll be taking a look at the new draw feature in CapCut. Now, this is the latest version of CapCut. And in order to have access to this feature, you'd need to select the text tool. And then to the farther right here, you'd see the option to draw. Now, upon selecting the draw tool, it will present you with pencils and erasers and basically different strokes which you could follow. So what this will do is it will allow you to use handwritten text whenever you're working with CapCut. So if you wanted to customize your edits, it would allow you to do just that. And as you can see here, we have a variety of options or brush strokes to choose from. We have from basically sharp to blur to even brush strokes with arrowheads. Now, as you can see here, whenever you're marking on the screen, it would automatically create a zoom effect you could actually see what you're doing so upon creating this effect now as you can see here if we should tap on the check mark it will automatically pop up the option to add graphs now whenever you're adding graphs it will basically add transitions for you so what you could do is to add keyframes in between the clip so let me add a few keyframes so you can add keyframes to actually add some animation to, to this. So let me select graph and you could use easing graph, easing tool and just select a variety of options to, to basically make your animation pop. Now, this is quite useful because as you know, sometimes you might need to add your own um, highlights to an edit and you would definitely utilize this option here. Let me get rid of that. The draw option is especially useful whenever you are trying to highlight specific parts of your video which you are editing. Because as you know, the stickers, sometimes they aren't efficient enough. And let's give that a few seconds to load. And you could change the size of the brush. You could change the hardness and the opacity you could also erase the brush by using the eraser tool, selecting the size and the opacity as well. Now, you'd need to ensure that you have a stable enough connection to actually have access to these features. As you know, CapCut runs an online, well, basically CapCut runs using an online server. So you'd need to have access to the internet to be able to use these features. But that is basically the draw tool in a nutshell. Um, it is fairly new and it is a unique tool. You could test it out, test out the different brushes, the different textures that are provided there for you. And let me know what you think in the comments. So this is just a synopsis or an overview of the draw tool. You can access it by clicking on the text tool in CapCut and access draw and add your own custom animations and effects to this. So thank you for watching. Hacker Triple Seven out.